Hey guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks yet again, and today we are back with our diving bell supply ship. I almost forgot what it was there, but anyway, yes, this is our diving bell supply ship. After episode one, this is what we have. We have the hull, we have the superstructure, we also have the stairs up the back of the superstructure, and a huge deck. Look at that, it looks awesome. There is a megalodon in the background, don't know what that's doing up there, but today what I want to do is figure out whether we should actually just fix this back together in like a straight line and then add the bridge on top of this which make it even taller or we actually put a front on this and make it look nicer that way I'm not sure how to do it but let's go ahead and try alright so if we were going with uh, what we have right here maybe it would look normal to do it as we are gonna do it right now but maybe it looks weird doing it this way let's go ahead and see so if I type in window yes we're gonna go ahead and grab this and we're going to go ahead and shove these guys into here, here, and here. There we go. Going forwards from there, we're going to go this way. We're going to do one there, one here, and one there as well. And I guess one in the center too, just because we can. All right, cool. Now that we've done that, let's go ahead and fix all these guys together. So from there down to here would be awesome. And I don't know, would it be weird to do another story on top of this? I think it probably would. Alright, so I've whacked a door on the back so that we can add this to here, there we go, very nice. And yeah, I mean it would be weird, I think, to actually add this to the top, but let's go ahead and see. So if I go ahead and grab that, all the way over to here, we cut that, we move them upwards to there, paste them in, there do we go. We then shove these guys into the bottom like this, and I guess I could do this on the side, uh, and presumably this would look right. But I don't know, maybe it doesn't. Anyway, shove that onto there just like so. And, I guess, merge this in. Alright, spawn that in, see what it looks like. Alright, so, so far, that is what it looks like. Let's go ahead and try and add an extra, I guess, an extra story on top of this. And that's where the bridge will be. Alright, so, what I'm going to do is actually go to Windows. And the way that I'm going to build this in might seem a little bit strange to begin with. Uh, but I think once I've done it a little bit, you guys will then be on board. So, we're going to go with black. We're going to shove this guy right in the center right here. We're going to do another one right next to it. From there, we're going to go to white. And we're going to do these guys going up and forwards just like so. From there, I think I'm going to add an extra one of these. Because I can. And then we're going to start moving it backwards again because I can. So, let's go with a 3x3. Three three, shove it onto there. Presumably the right way around. So, kind of like this. And if I can shove that onto there properly, that would be awesome. Unfortunately, it seems that I can't. That's really annoying. But if I do this, we should be able to maybe smack it onto there instead. So if I flip it over, just like that, we can then shove it onto there, delete this guy, and get rid of it. Alright, cool. From there, we're going to go ahead and grab another one of these, turn it around, smack it into there. That is awesome. We're going to go ahead and then add some of these guys going up from there like this. Awesome, and then I think we'll do another one of these, just like that. We'll shove another one of these onto there, and then I need it to come outwards. Which I'm gonna do by doing this. So we've got one of them up and one of them down, that's fine. And then I think if I then add these guys back onto here, uh, like this again, we can do one of those. Then we can flip it to one of these guys, here we go. And then we give it one of these guys on again, there we go. So I think that's what the window setup is going to look like. We then get our wings on the sides, and it should look pretty good too. So now we raise this up, we build the bottom in, and maybe that'll look okay. Alright, so raise it up by one, two, three, and four. There we go, move it forwards twice again, and paste it into... Uh, maybe that's one too high, I think that's it. Alright, hold on. Let's do this real quick. There we go. And it should go directly on top of there. Alright, paste it. Nice! Yeah, so, this might look weird to begin with, but it might also look okay. So, let's shove that onto... Oh, we can't even do that. <laughs> we can't even do that. I think this is actually going to have to just drop down to there, and I'm going to have to build it in all nice, I guess. Alright, so that's what it looks like when it's actually built in, and I do think that looks a little bit strange. But, if we go around this and we actually add some extra windows to it, it might end up looking okay. So I'm going to do this type of dealio right here, and we're going to do that all the way around. And there we go. So I've added the roof, I've added some extra pieces on the top. Let's go ahead and see what that looks like actually in the game, and is it too tall? I think maybe it is, but actually at the same time, 
Maybe that's fine. As long as I can somewhat make it look right, I think that's okay. Uh, I think there's probably too many windows down here, so we'll get rid of some of those. And, yeah, I think we can make this look okay. Maybe. You know, I'm starting to wonder if this would look nicer if these were just like one by, oh sorry, three by twos or two by threes. Maybe if they were a little bit taller like that, it would look nicer. I'm not entirely sure. I don't know how, how I feel about this. Like, those going in seems a bit weird, but at the same time, I, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well anyway, uh, let's go to the back and actually start working on that a little bit too. So grab the white and essentially do this all the way to the back end. It's going to go all the way down to here, I guess. Yep, sure. We're then going to build these guys in like this. So if I can, let's just go ahead and shove those into there-ish. Yeah, there-ish, makes sense. Uh, all the way down and all the way down, I guess. Yep, sure. And then we are going to need to add holes and stuff into that to make it look a little bit nicer, but that's okay. Oh, and I suppose I'm going to have to paint it too, so let's go ahead and jug that in the right color. There we go, do that as well. Uh, on the top, obviously we're going to go with the same color we've been doing the tops with before, and the inside I guess is going to be red as well. There we go. So far that actually looks very strange, but I think we can do this. Alright, so, I am going to go up one higher. Just one. Uh, oh, I say one. I mean two. That's fine. Uh, so we'll send this all the way down to the end. And yes, it looks like it's getting really, 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 really tall. But, overall, it's actually going to look fine. At least I think so, anyway. So, do that all the way down to there. Do this one as well. There we go. I could leave that white, I suppose. Uh, but I have a feeling that that might not look too good. Alright, jug that in there. Good. Let's go ahead and jug this in here. On the inside, we could do this. Red, there we go, red and red, and I guess we might as well make that red too. Okay, right, this looks weird. Alright, so from there, what do we actually want to do? I don't really know, so what I'm thinking is we send this from here out to the side. Uh, we'll go ahead and drop that down, very nice. Let's go ahead and delete... Uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, okay, right, hang on. Uh, four, four, sure, right, so, what I want to do is have, oh, what do I want to do? I don't know whether this will look right, but essentially I want one of these in here like this, and then one of those in there like that, but I don't really think that's the shape that I'm going for. Not really, so I think I'm actually just going to go with this, and this, and then down here, the same, I guess? So, we're actually going to go down to the floor, that's fine, one and two. And we're going to delete all of this as we go. Actually, maybe not on the floor. Maybe like one higher than the floor or something. So, delete all of these, there we go. And then do that. And that, there we go, alright, cool. So, I'm going to do this, and we're essentially just going to have it come down a bit. Until the next one, which is here. Although I think it should be more of a rectangle than this, but that's fine. So we'll actually go to the next one instead. Here we go. So if we build that up there, we can then delete all of this out to the end. There he is. Uh, deleting all of this too, except the bottom and the top one. And then I think we can just shove these in. So that goes there. This goes here. And then I'm going to delete all of this. And maybe that'll look fine? I don't know. Delete, delete. Very good. Let's go ahead and paint this into here, 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 and here. And there as well. Alright, all the way around. And I guess that's fine. I don't really know. Alright, so that is what we currently have. Yes, it looks very, very top heavy, and that is because it actually is. I don't know how I'm going to fix that, but uh, so far, so good. Everything seems to be working fine, except the fact that it's tipped over. But don't worry about that too much. Alright, so the way I see it, the next thing that we need to do is actually add a bit of a walkway out there, which is going to be about three wide. So, let's go ahead and send this up to around here. Very good. And essentially, this is going to go all the way down to the end as well. Uh, to around here, I guess. Yeah, sure. Uh, there's going to be ways in and ways out of this, but for now, we're just going to do that. Okay, so, uh, let's go ahead and drag that red. Drag this red. On the edges, it is going to be grey, and grey, and if we go down to the end, grey. There we go. So yeah, so far, so weird. 
Okay, so we've got the big holes on the sides, and now we actually have some doors on the inside, because I figured that made sense. Uh, and now we're going to add some windows type stuff, and maybe that'll be it. I'm not sure. We then need to stabilize this thing somehow, but pff, I really don't know how that's going to go. Alright, so more windows have been placed inside of here. We now need to actually add, like, a bunch of random stuff down the bottom as well, uh, which are essentially just holes that let water out. Uh, if the water gets on the deck, then it needs a way to get off the deck, so uh, I'm going to add some random details down the sides that allow the water to get out of the way, I guess. Okay, so those right there are the holes that we've added to it. I thought they would look nice in those colours, but actually, if I paint everything red, uh, I actually think that'll look better, so I think that's what I'm going to do right now. Once we've done that, we need to add some other random details about this thing and just try and make it look better overall. Alright, so there it is. I've painted all of those red. I added some rope anchors down the sides because I thought that would look nice. And the ship is still flipping over, so I'm going to quickly try and deal with that at least a little bit. I'm going to add some of the uh, control surfaces to the bottom and maybe that'll stop it rolling so much. Okay, so it is slightly better. It will roll over eventually, but yeah, I've added these guys to the sides to hopefully stop that happening so much. Uh, we will have to do some sort of stability system in this thing in order to make it work, but that's that's all right. That's part of the course. Anyway, um, overall, I actually think it's looking pretty good. I do like the fact that we did go taller with it. I think that actually makes it look a little bit nicer. Um, and yeah, the back end is starting to look pretty good too. I don't know whether we should actually make it go a little bit further back, like actually have this thing be longer. Um, I'm starting to think yes, but I don't really know. I'm not sure. So what I'm going to do is actually remove the back end, and I am going to bring it backwards, and we'll see if extending it looks any good. It might actually look rubbish, but we'll see. Okay, so the new length is actually just going to have an extra one of those holes on it. So that seems fine. Delete these guys right here. Obviously, we are going to have to paint this guy, and we're going to have to add the rope anchors back in, because I didn't manage to copy those. Uh, from there, we're actually going to go backwards, and we're going to grab this entire thing, and I guess we're just going to go ahead and try and push it back in. If I cut this, does it grab everything? It seems to. Very nice. Shove it back onto there. There we go. And merge it. There we go. It is actually a hell of a lot longer, but I think that actually works. I think that looks pretty good. Oh yeah, definitely. That definitely works. Alright, cool. I'm going to go ahead and put the rope anchors back in there. I'm also going to add like one or two, or maybe even three rope anchors across the top, and we'll have some ropes cross over there too. Alright, so there we go. I've added the crosses, but I don't actually think they look that good, so I'll probably end up getting rid of those. But overall, the rest of it actually looks pretty nice. Let's go to the inside of it. Oh, not the inside inside, but, you know, the inside outside, this bit, and have a little walk around. Actually, you know what? Let's just go ahead and save it real quick, and we'll go put it next to the other one that we've already got out there. Alright, so sticking them next to each other, you can see that, uh, yes, we've made it longer by actually quite a lot right there. We've obviously made it taller as well, as you guys can see, and I do think it is starting to get there and starting to look actually pretty good. Uh, I do like the way the back looks. It is going to change slightly and it's not going to be a normal supply ship because we're going to have to build some sort of structure on the back to allow for a really big winch to be suspended in the sky and uh, to be able to lower us down. Although, actually, now that we have pulleys, I don't have to do it that way. Interesting. But yeah, I think this is where we're actually going to leave it today. I want to say thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.